Hi, I'm Zachary Bronson, and welcome to the pregame show on TNT for the NBA Finals Game 6. This is Kale and this is Dylan, and um, just discuss the, uh, what do you think of the game? So, my predictions are, I think the Suns are actually kind of glad that they lost that game, because in my opinion, what DeAndre Ayton said after the game was, he's glad that they lost, so that way they can be the underdogs and come back and win. So, my predictions is, the only way that they're going to be able to win, like, even have a chance, is they're going to have to force game seven, because if, like, they're going to have to make sure to contain Giannis to 30 points, and they're going to have to make sure that Drew Holiday gets no less than two seals and Chris Middleton does not break loose. Um, I think that the Bucks are going to win because if you look at it, they came down from 2-0 and home games, they just swept them in their home games. And I think going back to home, going back to Milwaukee, they have a chance to win in front of their home crowd. They're going to capitalize on that. Even though you got Chris Paul and Devin Booker on the other side, they're still just going to try to do it for their hometown and bring a ring back to Milwaukee. And Personally, I think the Suns are going to win because they know the Bucks. They know this is game time. This is Bucks win. Yeah, the series is over. The Suns want to want to win this so bad. They want to win their first championship, and I think that Paul George and Devin Booker are just gonna go off. They're gonna do everything they can to win. I think the defense is gonna be stellar. I think the offense is gonna be good. I just think that the Suns want this so bad, and now they realize that if they lose, it's over. Um, you wanna ask us any questions? Um. So, what do you think would happen if Giannis broke loose and had a 40-point game like he did? And I think the Suns are going home, and I think that if Giannis does break 40 and they win, they're going to need Chris Paul to put up at least 50, Devin Booker to get, like, 60, and, like, no turnovers. No turnovers at all. Yeah. Um, your thoughts on um, if Yonix even touches the 40 mark, he's going over it, like, no doubt. Because I have a feeling if Giannis can break loose first and second quarter, he's probably going to reach 50 to 60. And I mean, Giannis getting that many points, it's just not, it's not fair anymore. Because, I mean, you literally have not necessarily a big three, but you have Giannis, two-time MVP, back-to-back. -back. You have... Chris Middleton and Drew Holiday are two under. They're both underrated at their position. I think they need more. They deserve more recognition. That's going to be all for the pregame show. And my name is Zachary Bronson. This is Kel. This is Dylan. And uh, see you at game time.